Bye guys. <laughs>
So this is day four. I had a salad, applesauce, and two eggs for breakfast. I had this really good banana smoothie from the mall that we went to and some queso and chips. And then I had a couple snacks. This was all in the span of like five hours, I think, or maybe even more than that. And when I got home, I had some ham and hot soup and some rice. This day we were super not motivated as we were before because we did this workout at nine o'clock at night since we had a busy day. Um, but overall we did we did exactly what we set out to do for this week and afterward i had some chinese food i did not eat all of this by the way because i was full from earlier but that is the end of day four and day five was definitely a lot better we did our workout around like 10 and then i had work afterward so i brought my rice and then i had some diet dr pepper and these mini m ms which were so good and then i had a quesadilla at the end of my work day and that's all i ate that day and that is all that i have for day five here's day six i had some farina with two pieces of bacon and then i tried this meal replacement fat burning whatever protein drink it was pretty good and i will have it again but then this is what i had for lunch some ramen and here the egg was just so perfectly made i had to show you guys uh but then i was also snacking on those little chips that i got from chinese the other day then this is us at the gym and that is the end of day six
is after the workouts that we did, my final verdict on the 12 3 30 challenge is that it really does work. It definitely made me feel much like tighter, helped with my bloating, I think, um, a lot. It just made me feel like really good after doing it too. And if you want to start getting into like working out and like doing it kind of slowly but still pushing yourself, I think the 12 3 30 challenge is actually really good. I mean, of course, working out by itself is helpful, but like doing the 12 3 30 only for like your workout would be good. But then after a certain point, it should be like almost like a warm up, and then like you add other things, and that is how you sculpt the body the way that you want. But 12 3 30 is such a good workout, I really recommend it for everybody. It's not too difficult, and you can do it and you can get through it and when you see yourself getting better it actually makes it more fun to do overall it's just a good experience and i think everybody should do it if you were to go on a diet i think that um it would definitely like speed the process or give you um more results we did do some additional workouts as well as the 12 3 30 it did actually become our warm-up at the beginning of our workouts we worked out for about like from an hour to 30 minutes to two hours and 30 minutes. And we did that every day. But I do think that you should add, depending on your goals, that you should add either like a run or a jog to the 12 3 30, like weight training workout or like something else to add to the workout because alone I don't think everybody will get the results that they were hoping for as soon as they were hoping for. So yeah guys that is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys um, enjoyed me and my mom in this video because we did it together and it was really fun. I recommend going with a friend or a family member to the gym to keep you motivated and to keep you accountable. But yeah guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun making it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! <laughs>